Hello and welcome to this Adlice Jag tutorial. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to use Adlice Jag to disinfect your machine. So first of all, what's Adlice Jag? It's a diagnostic software with built-in anti-malware layer. So it will display everything on your machine, just like the Microsoft Autorun software would do. And it will also classify every item found on the machine like a, a regular anti-malware. The difference with uh, classic anti-malware like Rockular is that it will not only show malicious items, it will also show legit items uh, with green classification, suspicion, suspicious items, and also uh, the unknown items. So my machine is currently infected with system error. This is um, a crapware or a rug. So it's a fake software uh, saying there is a lot of infections on the machine, but it's all fake. And this is uh, detected by pretty much all the anti malware. So I'm going to run Diag. Let's push this side. And you see it's quite easy to, to use. There is big scan button, so click on it. And here you can customize your scan. So Diag is a diagnostic software, so it's highly customizable. You can choose the role you want to scan. So for example, here we have processes. We can scan process memory and search for in process. Uh, you, you can only scan if you want schedule task if you know you have only one task to to target for a fast scan uh, but yeah if you don't know if you arrive on new machine that is infected and you don't know what's on it uh, it's better to just do the default scan so let's do this so now it's scanning my machine it will take some time while it's scanning, you can check, take a look at the results and you will see the scan is performing real time and you already have classifications on items. Um, so green is safe. You also have the name of the detection, why it's known safe. Here it's system files, so classified as safe. And we start, we're starting having malicious items here with the hardware optimizer. That's the detection name for system error. And everything else is green. So I'm going to skip the scan and see you in a minute. So here we go. The scan is done. It took about two minutes and there's another filter that you can turn on is hide safe items and show malicious only. Uh, in, in this case, it does the same because uh, we only have those two items. But in the other views, it, sh it will show different probably. Yeah. So yeah, we have found our infection and you can see it's pre-checked by default. So it makes things a lot easier for removal. Just click removal. Oh, there's something I forgot. You can export the scan report. Just to click on the report button here. And you can even upload it to, to our cloud for fast sharing. So yeah, you, you can retrieve all the detections we have in the main view. And you can even export the, the, the report to JSON or TXT file or even open it directly. 
the format is different. This is the old format from uh, the old version of Rockular, for example. So, okay, now let's take a look at the removal. Once you click removal, every item you checked will be reported into that view with um, a background color corresponding to the classification. So here, red is malicious, orange is suspicious. I haven't checked any green items. I can do this just to show you. So now I get my safe item. You know, it's green. Uh, this item is not safe and should not be removed. That's what it says. So I'm not going to remove it. You just verify everything is good. You don't have checked a legitimate item. And you proceed to removal. So as you can see, the system error window has been wiped off because the process was killed. So now let's take a look at what's what was removed. Status. So the status said killed, killed, process were killed. So now all the filters are grayed out because it only shows the removal uh, results. Okay, everything that was not checked for removal is hidden. So you can see the task were removed, delete, delete, everything is removed, and we don't have anything else. So only task and processes. You can export the report again. This is a removal re report this time. Delete report. And it shows up quite different now because there is only the removal tab. You have a check saying it succeeded. And same, you can upload or open. Okay. So now the removal is done. You can just click finish and your machine is clear. So thank you for watching and see you in the next video.